If you have some excess or leftover rice and you have no clue about what to do with it, then you can try making this Indo-Chinese appetizer. Well, I'm talking about the sesame honey rice balls that I'm going to be making today in Spice Box. So to make the sesame honey rice balls, you will need some rice, carrots, French beans, some capsicum, cornstarch, all-purpose flour, garlic, chilies, honey, oil, sesame seeds, pepper, coriander leaves, soy sauce, some spring onions and some salt. So I'm going to start by heating some oil in the pan first. Once the oil is hot, you add the onions. Next you add the garlic, the crushed garlic. Then you add the green chilies. Now you saute this for about 3 minutes. Next you start adding in the chopped vegetables. So that's the French beans followed by capsicum carrots just stir them up well now you saute this for 5 minutes after you have sauteed them for 5 minutes you add the soy sauce a little bit of pepper followed by some salt once this is done you can turn off the heat and allow it to cool now to this I'm going to add the cooked rice you mix this up Then you add the coriander leaves. Combine them all well. Once that's done, then you add the corn flour. Combine this too. Finally, you add the honey. Now you mix them up all well before you form them into small balls. So once this has cooled, you can start making them into lemon sized balls. Once you have formed small lemon sized balls, you can set them aside in the refrigerator for 15 minutes. While the rice balls are cooling in the refrigerator, you can start making the batter. So you add some salt to the flour. Add some water. Give them a nice mix. Start dipping the balls gently into the batter. And then roll them over the sesame seeds. Set this aside. You do the same with the rest of them. Once the oil is hot, you can gently start immersing one by one into the pan. You fry them until they turn golden brown. It's very easy and quick to bring together this great evening snack that has an interesting combination of flavors and textures. Now you can serve them hot with some nice tomato ketchup.